How do you know if you have diabetes? Diabetes is a condition featuring unusually high levels of glucose in the bloodstream. Insulin, produced by the pancreas, is used by the body to lower blood glucose levels. If someone's pancreas doesn't generate enough insulin, their body will develop diabetes. A short list of symptoms of diabetes would include severe hunger and thirst, more urge to urinate, and fatigue. But the surest way of knowing whether you have diabetes is having a blood sugar test, also known as a glucose tolerance test. Type 1 diabetes is the more acute form. It is typically treated with special dietary restrictions, exercise and occasionally with insulin. Type 1 diabetes usually will be treated with special diet, exercise, and a weight loss plan before insulin is added. This form of diabetes is considered an insulin-dependent disease. A less severe form of diabetes, type 2 diabetes is first treated with a diabetic diet, exercise and weight loss. If these measures are not successful in controlling blood sugar and insulin levels, oral medications may be added. Insulin is then finally considered if these also are unsuccessful. Type 2 diabetes normally occurs in adults who are middle age or older, which is why it is sometimes called late onset diabetes in this case, he pancreas still produces the right levels of insulin but the body has become resistant to it. It is feasible to delay the onset of type 2 diabetes if it runs in the family. Through losing weight, getting the right amount of exercise and controlling your diet, you can manage. If type 2 diabetes is not treated, eventually the same complications may ensue as those seen with type 1 diabetes. Gestational diabetes is seen in pregnant women. Normally it disappears after the birth of the baby, however, treatment for the mother to stabilize the blood glucose levels will decrease the chance of complications to the baby as well as mother. Juvenile onset diabetes is another major form of diabetes that affects many children. It is believed to be the onset of type 1 diabetes. If a child is showing even a few of the symptoms of diabetes, it's vital that they be checked by a doctor. It is estimated that over 2 million adolescents are in the pre-diabetes stage. This is mostly due to being overweight. In this condition, blood glucose levels are high but not high enough to be considered diabetes. Teens usually develop this between the ages of 12 and 19. Thank you. Click the link below for more information.